Hey guys, so this is a part of the Canada Goose series that I am filming. So this one is just a quick video uh, to compare sizing and just to let you see how it looks on me for the Fusion Fit. So I will give you an idea of like how tall you should be. Um, if you want to be looking into a fusion fit but usually a fusion fit is like for more uh petite i would say if you're like maybe five three or so like five four you would maybe be like a borderline regular fit uh and fusion fit and I think from 5'5", five, five, I think you would be good with a regular fit. And for reference, I am 5'7", and this is the Loretta jacket. So this is a slimmer fit jacket. Okay, and I'm just going to try on the uh, Fusion. In the Ross Claire. gonna tuck in my sleeves so you know the length of this yeah it is above my wrist which you wouldn't want and it's pretty short this is a medium But everybody's body is different so you might be taller and have maybe like a shorter torso and shorter arms so if you feel like that you do then I would definitely try this if you are taller and here's the waist and for me I typically have a smaller frame so I usually are between an extra small and a small but because of my shoulders uh, I'd say it's maybe a little bit more broad but my arms are definitely longer than someone of my height so I usually would go for a small if it has sleeves. <laughs> or at least right now. But the jacket that I have that, I did get in an extra small, but the buttock area, so let's just try on mine. I don't have the fur on it right now, uh, but this is the Kensington and it has the snap buttons. So it just extends like that pretty nicely for more room because the one that I want to replace this with is the Trillium and it doesn't have this option for the buttock. So I did try in a extra small and a small. Both do look good, but in terms of the hip area, I feel like the small is better for me and I'll show you that afterwards. But this is the Kensington in an extra small so here i'll even tuck in my sleeves again so yeah it's a little short and i did have them redo it so it is just a tad bit shorter than what it was but that doesn't change this part here which is a little bit short and especially the fact that my hands are always cold, having something a little bit longer just gives you a little bit more insurance. So here's the Mystique jacket, just a, an example of uh, the sleeves coming down a lot longer and it's nice and comfortable. Anyways, this is the Mystique in a small. So I'll just show you how long it goes on me uh, and this 
was purchased to wear with long dresses in the winter time. So the next one is on my list, the Trillium, and I'm just going to compare the extra small and a small that I tried on in store, as you will see. So here's the Trillium Parka, and I tried on the extra small and the small, as I mentioned earlier. So as you can see in the extra small, the torso area from my shoulder to my waist has a bit of a v-shaped form so i don't really find that really flattering and in the hip area it really hugs it a little bit tighter so i find that the small size is a little bit more uniform and flattering that also allows more room for movement when you're moving your arms around and as you can see the sleeves too they are longer and hit to about my knuckle area which is where it should hit uh, for this jacket so i decided on the small size over the extra small and did decide on the black as well but i did try it in different colors to compare so if you're interested in seeing which one might be uh, better suited for you, you can also compare the colors, so I have them here. Okay guys, thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe if you hadn't already, and if you have, thank you for supporting, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!